My name is Tim Place. I'm the head football coach, defensive coordinator at Urbana University. Uh, it's an honor. Uh, it's humble, humbling to uh, be talking to you representing Urbana University and Blue Knight football program. Um, when we took this program over, and I say we, previous head coach Jeff Smith, who's still on the staff as our offensive line coach, Deion Doster, uh, who's still on staff as a co-offensive coordinator, wide receivers coach, probably was one of the worst programs in the country at any level. Uh, as we've improved as a program, uh, the defense has improved as well, uh, garnering some uh, conference recognition as well as some national recognition. Um, prior to the 2004 season, I approached the previous head coach. He and I came to agreement where, you know what, you can run with it, do what you want to do. What I'm about to talk to you about is our coverages that we use from our eight-man front configurations. Uh, per the previous videos, uh, we're going to be either 425 bear package or stack package uh, if a team's going to run based on down and distance tendencies. I guess if you wanted to define us as a defense, we are a situational defense. If a team's going to run the ball in a certain situation, we're going to be eight-man front football. If they're going to throw the ball, we'll be in our nickel package. Uh, what I'm going to talk to you about uh, in this upcoming video is what we do as far as coverages from our single, uh, single safety look. What I'm going to talk to you about now is our black coverage. Uh, we define all our zone coverages by colors. Uh, black is our cover three. Um, the way we go about installing and teaching black, let me draw it from, again, a pro formation, and I'll work out. 21 personnel. It's our belief in black, again, which is cover three, that the second level players must control number two. In its simplest form, those are their landmarks. Now, they need to understand, they do understand as they're driving to the landmarks, they're reading progression people. Two to one, two to one, three to two, two to one, based on the formation, two to one. Um, again, as they drive to their landmarks, they need to understand heads got to be on a swivel. They must be looking up who they're responsible for. Number two can do three things. He can press vertical. He can work out. He can work in. So that's all we really focus on. That's what we talk about is what is what is two doing? What is two's release? Is it a vertical release, an out release, an in release? As far as what 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 does he do after his stem? As I talked about earlier, on the snap of the ball, Sam and Mike want to pick it up, put it down. They are run stoppers. So in essence, they might get sucked up on a play action pass. If that is the case, they want to turn their backs to the quarterback, sprint to the landmark, looking for routes working from the inside out. That's if it's play action pass. Strike and whip on the snap of the ball, they're gonna buzz their